Hi, this is Mike Negami, Lean Sigma Bug Belt. This episode is about the second Lean Sigma characteristics that we must always be aware of during any Lean Sigma activities. The title is Kaizen, more than improvement. Here is an interesting story. You may know that Kaizen in English means continuous improvement, but you may not know that Kaizen in Japanese just means improvement. Now I'm lecturing Japanese people that Kaizen in the Roman alphabet means continuous improvement. By the way, other Japanese words like Muda, which means West, and Genba, which means the real place, commonly used by many Lean Sigma people in the US as well. Lean and Six Sigma have been influenced by Japanese business methodologies that much. Also, I feel that those Lean Sigma people have more than a little of the sense of longing and respect for Japanese businesses. It's a little sad to know that most Japanese people don't know foreigners feel that way at all. I'm aiming for the day Japanese people have confidence and pride in Lean Sigma. I return to the topic of Kaizen. The basic improvement activities in Toyota are to eliminate waste thoroughly. What's great about Toyota is that they clarified the definition of waste. They named it the seven waste. The seven waste are defect over production, waiting, non-added processing, transportation, inventory, and motion. Toyota is saying those seven waste should be as close to zero as possible. Lean Sigma people here in the US memorize the seven West as downtime. This acronym consists of initials of each West. I'll explain about downtime in the next episode as well as more about the seven West. Also, you may think, since my job is not manufacturing, I've got nothing to do with the seven West. That is absolutely not true. I'll explain about that as well in the next, next episode. The foundation to achieving Kaizen is the PDCS cycle. You absolutely cannot achieve Kaizen without this. I think that all junior high schools should teach this to their students. This is such a great concept, but in fact, it is very simple. P is for plan. Before whatever you do, first prepare and make a plan. D is for do, execute the plan. C is for check. Evaluate how well you achieved your plan at some point. And A is for act, address or improve the situation based on the evaluation. Don't end there. Continue to the next round P. Continue repeating this cycle. That's why this is named PC, PDCS cycle. This is a great foundation of improvement activities. However, it is such a shame that this is known and utilized by only a small amount of people. In Lean Sigma, we are expected to incorporate the concept of this PDCA cycle completely in the target process. It's especially important in designing your process to allow operators to conduct the plan and check functions effectively and seamlessly. I've now completed this episode Kaizen More Than Improvement. Before going into the third Lean Sigma characteristic, the next, next episode is about downtime in a little more detail. Thank you for viewing. If you like my videos, please click the subscribe button. Thanks.